So I just got done listening to a little bit of Gary B. Uh, get my afternoon cranking. Love you, Gary B. But he was talking to a mom, and they were talking about how to be this parent, uh, a good parent, whatever that means, or uh, an inspiring parent, this and that. And, you know, I got to thinking real quick while he was talking, He, the mom continued to ask how she could communicate uh, with her children to position them, these are my words, uh, to maximize and be who they were created to be and be the most and maximize the most out of this life. And I was thinking really quick, something that really just caught me right away was, you know, there's so many people that are trying to communicate to their children and they just try and try and try and try and try, but they are not children and they do not remember being a child, so they are not communicating in such a way that their child receives it. And so, one of the interesting things that I know to be true in my life, as well as many others, is using authentic communication. And to be able to use authentic communication, uh, you gotta be able to communicate to three people. You gotta be, be able to communicate to yourself, like your heart, not your brain. Thinking is not communicating. Check that, thinking is not communicating. Actually, authentically communicating with yourself to your heart. Then number two, communicating to your creator, your maker, uh, whatever you call it, the universe. Um, you have to be able to broadcast authentic communication that way. And then number three, the people around you. And so if you can communicate to yourself authentically, then you are gonna have no problem communicating to your children authentically. And if you want to know your children and actually like understand them and know them, you must know yourself. And when you know yourself and you communicate authentically, your kids are gonna open up and they're going to receive what you have to say because it's true, it doesn't have a motive or an intent to make them do something that they don't wanna do. And even if they don't know if they wanna do it or not, because of the way in which you're communicating it to them, they've already t shut down and turned off and they're looking for a way out of the conversation. So be you, know who you are, Take the time, invest the most valuable thing you have to know who you are. Communicate that with yourself and everyone around you will open up. And your relationships will have an energy, have a power to them in which you've never experienced before. Those are my two minutes, deuces.